Hi, I'm Michael Hauser, undergraduate education GIS librarian here at the University of Connecticut Libraries Map and Geographic Information Center, better known as MAGIC. Uh, over the past couple years, we've been working with the Connecticut Department of Energy and Environmental Protection to create a historical index of infrared aerial photography for the Connecticut coast from 1974 to 2000. Uh, we're excited to announce that this imagery is now available to the public via multiple vehicles, including MAGIC's website, the Connecticut ECO, or CT ECO. So you may be wondering, what exactly is an infrared image? Why does it look so different from, say, Google Earth or Google Maps when you see satellite imagery or aerial photography? Infrared imagery uh, actually shows vegetation in shades of red, and then the real reason why infrared's used in this case is because water will show as a very dark color, like black. And what that allows you to do is to really see clearly the shoreline, the difference between vegetation and water. To access this new resource from MAGIC, you simply go to the Aerial Photography Indexes and select a specific time period and location. For example, the aerial imagery for Griswold Point, Old Lyme, Connecticut in 1974. Because this series of photographs were repeated over several decades, you can compare different years and the changes that have occurred. Here is the side-by-side -side comparison of Griswold Point in 1974 and 2000. We've seen an infrared aerial view of Griswold Point. Here's what you see at Griswold Point today. MAGIC is also home to the Connecticut State Data Center, a center that includes census data support and resources for the state of Connecticut. Our goal here at MAGIC in the Connecticut State Data Center is to provide increased public access to critical resources related to the state of Connecticut. Uh, through partnerships, we're able to provide greater access to information, providing it directly through an internet accessible method uh, as well as providing high quality images of historical maps, aerial photography, and full data sets available for analysis, decision making uh, throughout the state. 